Technology with a purpose, what we really mean is technology that is focused on our game plan for success in Cargill and our purpose. We try and focus on digitalization and analytics that is um, influenced by what our customers are most interested in. So for instance, like iQuatic, it helps a shrimp farmer be more efficient. Dairy Intelligent helps dairy farmers be more efficient. We created a Meet My Farmer blockchain, which helped bring excitement and value to the Honeysuckle White brand. This is a new Cargill. This is a new Cargill with technology and a, and a new Cargill in terms of how we, how we generate value. The potential impact of technology can really help us meet the biggest challenges, whether it's food security, sustainability, and the livelihoods of our growers and, and making sure people continue to invest in, in growing food for our population. We've recently partnered with a company called Canthus that uses facial recognition. So rather than just looking at how the overall herd is performing, we can now recognize individual cows. We can better understand their behavioral patterns, how they're eating, their reproductive cycles, and we can help our customers get very specific about what individual animals on their farm needs. We're looking at new ways, new techniques, new insights to help the world feed a growing population and sustain our planet. One of the recent investments that Cargill has made is to partner with Techstars to start a technology accelerator called the Farm to Fork Accelerator. Through this program, Cargill will be connected to a number of startup founders, and we will have an active role in help guiding them in building their businesses, growing their businesses, and we want early visibility to those ideas. At the end of the day, you still can't eat bits and bites. So what we do as Cargill is still so important getting food to where it needs to be, nourishing the world. But we can use the bits and bites to do it more effectively and create value for all the players along the way.